What's up guys, it's your boys Wolke back with another Wolke video and today we're looking at Jonathan May May Majors, my goodness, reacts to Robert Downey Jr.'s Doctor Doom replacement of Kang in the MCU and he is heartbroken. We're going to be taking a look at this news article and are you up game for this? Are you excited about RDJ being uh, Doctor Doom? Would you rather have Kang or Doctor Doom? Let me know down in the comments, but before we go any further, make sure you guys are subscribed by hitting that white icon down at the bottom right. Hit that bell icon next to it, so when I do post videos like this one, you guys will get that little ring notification that Wilkie myself has posted that video. Then you guys can watch, comment, like, and share. And again, thank you guys so very much for that love and support that you guys do on this channel every single day. We are on the road to 100k, and I need all of you guys, so make sure you guys keep doing what you guys are doing. And with that being said, let's get into the video. Now, starting off the bat, if you guys don't know who we are talking about, we are talking about Robert Downey Jr. and Jonathan Majors, aka Kang, that was back in Ant-Man and the Wasp in Quantumania, and technically in Loki Season 2, um, which was kind of a bummer because I definitely enjoyed uh, Loki Season 2 and seeing Jonathan Majors in there, but Jonathan Majors did some bad stuff. He was um, found to be uh, with, I think it was assault. Um, I mean, you shouldn't be doing that. So I, I, I really don't feel s sad or bad. I mean, he definitely played a very good Kang in Ant, Ant, Ant Man and the Wasp and Quantum I cannot talk today. But for me, I'm excited about seeing Robert Downey Jr. as Doctor Doom. I would rather see Doctor Doom than Kang. Just saying. But what we are going to uh, look at is the article. With all the excitement around Robert Downey Jr.'s return to the MCU has led many to forget that Avengers Doomsday was a different movie at one point. Um, Avengers Kang Dynasty was going to be featuring Jonathan Majors in a major role and the actor has finally spoken about being replaced. I would rather see Avengers Doomsday than Avengers Kang Dynasty. Just saying. Um, Marvel Studios panel at San Diego Comic Con saw Kevin Feige announce big things for the MCU including the return of the Russo brothers which I am so excited for. The Russo brothers are bringing it back. I heard they were doing or signed for $80 million to do these two movies. Um, so $40 or $40 million a piece, but that's a lot of money. <laughs> um, I think also I heard that Robert Downey Jr. was paid big bucks for returning. Um, the biggest reveal, however, was the reveal of Robert Downey Jr. Uh, becoming Dr. Doom. Um, the Iron Man actor will return to play one of the most iconic villains and appear in the next two Avenger movies, leaving Majors as the odd man out after being found guilty of two misdemeanor counts of harassment and assault late last year and dropped by the studio. It goes on to saying, yeah, heartbroken, of course, Majors told TMZ after being asked about Marvel Studios' pivot I love Kang. Dr. Doom is wicked though. Um, so that's pretty much what he said. Major isn't looking to hold a grudge though showing love for the MCU and its fans after being asked about Kang returning at some point down the line. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I love him. He said, I love Kang. If that's what the fans want and that's what the Marvel wants, then let's roll. Hell yeah. It wouldn't be the first time Marvel Studios took it chance on a controversial controversial actor and majors knows that he talked about robert downey jr's comeback and how the oscar winner deserves all the praise he's getting i think it's fair that mr downey has been granted uh oop, where'd it go has been granted the patience courtesy and love and that ezra miller has gotten the same treatment um major said and that they are being allowed to work their art and be creative on that level. I didn't really get that. Interesting. So that's pretty much what we have this moment. Um, it, it looks like he's not holding a grudge, but he's definitely heartbroken that he can't continue as being King the Conqueror. Um, I've watched King in the comics and in certain TV shows and so forth. Again, I would rather see Dr. Doom. 
than Kang. But there's a lot of discrepancy and division in between people with the Marvel Universe with Doctor Doom being played as Robert Downey Jr. Again, there are people that have played multiple different people in Marvel. I mean, look at Thanos. The the actor, uh, what's his name? Brain fart. Josh Brolin. Okay, Josh Brolin played King or not King. Um, Thanos, and then he played in uh, Deadpool number two as Cable. So, I mean, he played two, well, not two bad guys, but. And not a vigilante, but an anti-hero, as you will. Um, we've seen other people play different characters in the MCU as before. We've seen Captain America, uh, Chris Evans play Johnny Storm. I mean, the list goes on and on and so forth like that. So, again, I'm up for seeing Robert Downey Jr. coming back. I think Robert Jr. Robert Downey Jr. is a fantastic um, actor. Um, even seeing him in Oppenheimer and other movies and so forth that I've seen him in the past. Again, I'm not saying I don't think that Jonathan Mayers is not a good actor. I definitely enjoyed him and he seemed very threatening as King. But again, you do some bad things, you're going to lose things. So with his misdemeanor of the assault and the harassment, you can't tell me that was going to be a good thing that if Disney and Marvel found out. So... Um, it's unfortunate he's not going to play Kang at this moment, but who knows? Maybe we might see in the future. Maybe we might not, but I am all for seeing RDJ as Dr. Doom. So let me down, down or let me know down in the comments, what you guys think about this. Would you rather have Kang or would you rather have Dr. Doom? And for Dr. Doom fans, would you want anybody else playing Dr. Doom? Or are you up for seeing Robert Downey Jr. play Dr. Doom? I'm up for anything. I just want to see some good, uh, superhero fighting and and dialogue and stories and stuff like that. I just want to see awesomeness. So, again, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed my take on this. Make sure you guys comment down below. Like I said, hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next one. So keep it real, keep it safe, and as always, keep nerding on, and we'll see you guys next time.